Hey guys, New Dog here, and welcome back to another episode. Today, we're looking at Anarchy Arcade. Now, this is in early access, and I will add, it's free to play, so you can download it now and start messing about with it. But yeah, what is Anarchy Arcade? Now, it's sort of like a sort of 3D shortcut sort of multimedia thing. Let's, let's go into it, and you can you'll have an idea. Right, so this is my first little arcade, and I started in this little room, and then I've added extra cabinets to it, and like, yeah, all sorts of stuff. So yeah, so this is basically the game, and the idea is, you can like, sort of leave these really cool arcade cabinet -y style shortcuts. So you could set up all your favourite games on Steam, and then like, simply access them through here, like, so I can go on to Cubic Castles and it's actually set so I look at the trailer at the minute but I can go into it and set it so it it like launches or if it previews something or if it's gonna I can like even change like exactly what it shows on setup but yeah I could just launch it straight away but I'm not gonna do that but yeah I just thought it was really cool like you have these different style arcade boxes like this is for Nazi Zombie Arcade and uh, yeah I'll just click on that and it it'll show like some of the screenshots I've took and then it'll start playing the trailer but you can just have it set like I say so it just like auto starts the game for you which is uh, yeah I think really cool uh, this is a picture it'll might take a little while to load but this I thought was quite cool I've actually linked this to my YouTube channel so yeah, that's actually my YouTube channel there, so I can actually like set up bookmarks on the internet for stuff, which is really cool. Yeah, I thought that was really cool, there's my channel. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I've obviously set up some PCs for proper PC gaming, so I've got Fallout New Vegas, I've got Counter-Strike, I've got uh, my little early access table here, and we've got Ziggurat on the... Uh, PC and then I've got uh, what have I got down here? I've got uh, Blockscape, Godos, Starbound, Action Hank, Nuclear Throne, and Toy Soldiers Complete. Uh, no arcades complete without a Mortal Kombat <laughs> arcade cabinet, surely. Oh, that just looks perfect. I love it. I think it's great. Yeah, we've got uh, Mount Your Friends here. I've uh, done a little like a uh, table style one for uh, Command and Conquer, Rin Alert 3, because I thought that fit best. But well, yeah, alright, we're going Coach Simulator, like the little Steam Box style with two pads, uh, Vertigious Gold. Or like a proper cabinet for FTL, like the, yeah, with the joystick in. I know you don't use a joystick. Then we've got the Jewel Racer for Need for Speed Undercover. I thought that was quite apt as a... Uh, it originally is designed on a game that were a, an arcade cabinet shooter. <laughs> We've got a little old goddess cabinet and hey, gang beast. Got our gang beast. Got two pads there for multiplayer, of course. And don't starve and mashed. Right, so yeah, there's some of the like cabinets you can put in, but there are all sorts of things. Now this is how you do it. Like you pick what you want to link to. So in a minute, I've just got all my games here on Steam. So, yeah, let's just pick any, uh, I don't know, like Fez, we'll go with Fez. And then it'll spawn the cabinet style, and then you can scroll with your mouse wheel to change it. So I could have like a, you know, just a copy of Fez on me, on the side. Or I could have like that style cabinet, or that style cabinet, or a little TV and a pad. Or well, that's like for racing games, uh, shooters. Like the sort of PC style with speakers. Uh, a little half cabinet style. Like, be cool to have like on a table or something. Uh, then you got the full like multiplayer cabinet. That, that's a pretty cool cabinet. I need to get some of those made actually. That style like the FTL. Uh, the Jewel Racer. And yeah, just all sorts. I think it's really cool. Like you can have it as like, little multimedia pictures on the wall. Which is cool. Yeah. Little like, uh, I guess like iPad, sort of touch display style. But yeah. There's some of the things you can make. 
Now, you don't just have to have it linked to games and stuff. Like, you've seen a few bits with the uh, YouTube bookmark I'm done up here. You can actually, like, link it to other, like, applications on your PC. So, you can have, like, say, Sony Vegas or, I don't know, even to your Facebook or, like, a Twitter. Yeah, there's definitely lots to play about with. But uh, as you play, you do uh, unlock rewards. Now, most of them were cabinet styles that I've already unlocked. Uh, I have unlocked, yeah, pretty much everything now. Yeah, there's a few I've not. As you can see, like a whole theatre for Cade there. And see me, that'd be cool to like link to, you know, Foo Bar or whatever music player you use. Maybe a playlist set up, which would be cool. Uh, we do also unlock other arcade rooms to... Uh, building so we're gonna have a look at my other room i'm gonna spend a little while in this as you can see there's some other ones i still need to unlock but i need to i need to get to ten thousand points so yeah got a way to go yet right so this is me or uh, other arcade and it's absolutely massive look got loads of rooms i think it's actually spread across yeah two floors which is a bit mental yeah so you can have a proper proper big one i might even better get all my games <laughs> No, probably not, but... Right, so, I thought in here I'd do me tower defence games. So I've got all my tower defence games in alphabetical order. So, yeah, let's go over these real quick. But yeah, I think it's really cool. Like, you can set categories in your Steam library like I do, and then, like, you know, have arcade cabinets and rooms for each one instead. Gives you a much more sort of visual, you know, uh, understanding of what you've actually got. And, uh, yeah, look... It sets them up really cool, like it sets up, you know, the, the picture it has on the side and at the top, you know, automatically. And a lot of them are perfect, you know, straight from the get-go. You can obviously, like, edit, you know, pretty much every little side and, you know, every picture on it. But yeah, I think it's really cool. I'm definitely going to do this. Uh, you know, set up a room, probably have, like, early access in here or something and, you know new games or currently playing you know in another room but yeah that's anarchy arcade and i definitely thought it was worth having a look at and definitely worth you know a, you know an hour of your time it's quite fun to just set up and look at all the different arcade cabinets but yeah check it out uh, i'll leave a link in the description but yeah like i say it's on steam's early access and it's actually currently free so yeah definitely do pick it up now all right thanks for watching guys and i'll see you Later. Bye.